。那我们现在要先呃去找出我们要的土跟我们要的沙到底是什么样的一个形态，然后怎么样子才是我们要的土团的要用的土。We first start off by looking for the type of earth subsoil that we will use, and what kind of sand is appropriate. 这个是从山上，就是挖出来比较黏的黏土。This blob on this section is from a local mountain, and it's a subsoil that has consistencies of clay. 这一个土呢，是这一个地方，这一块田向下挖五十公分。得出来的含沙的黏土。The second row consists of subsoil dug from the log from this current owner's land, 50 centimeters below ground, and it consists of sand. 那可以拍近一点，你会看到这两个土不一样的地方，一个是含了沙，一个是没有的。On the right, we have. What consists of certain sand, and on the left there is less sand. You can see the difference. 嗯，那可以理解它含沙也有一个原因，是因为这里靠海边，这边的海边的沙也是比较细致的。The current ground we stand on is used to be on a bed of ocean, so they are consist of. Certain sand and salt inside the soil. 那很久以前，这里也是海滩，也是海滩的。那山上的土下来，又跟这里的海滩相接之后，其实它还是有黏土，但是它含沙。The soil here consists of ocean ground beaches. There used to be a beach at this local area, so there is sand and salt. 大部分在高山上，我们比较容易得到这一排土，也就是比较接近粘性非常高的粘土。On higher ground, such as in mountains, you get more clay consistencies in the subsoil. 嗯，那我们看一下这一边，这是我们要的沙。This is the gravel we want. It's a little bigger than what we want. 一公分以下，接近零，这中间的石就是石，呃，沙状的物体都叫沙，都称沙。OK。Under one centimeter of gravel, we we term it as sand. 呃，我们今天用的沙比较糟糕，是它只有一种 size。The Worst part of this particular group of gravel is there's only one size. 最好的是你从一公分到零都有，就是很均匀的。The best condition is to get gravel from one centimeter to zero centimeters. 嗯，那但是都是大的也没关系，都是小的也没关系。We can work around this. This is okay. 对。那我们今天是最讨厌的，就是最糟糕的状况。This is the worst condition you can achieve. 嗯，所以是都可以的，只是怎么去 balance 跟那个粘土去做平衡而已。You will need to balance out this type of gravel with clay. 这个很好，因为它一开始挖出来的时候，它已经是沙跟粘土已经是有在里面了，但是粘土偏多。This is a better condition to have because sand is already inside the subsoil, and so is the clay. Uh, I used this clay, and then added sand. The clay is one. This sand is two. There is one part clay subsoil. And two parts gravel. One, two, one to two parts. 嗯 ，together 把它混合在一起变成它。A mixture creates what we have here. 
。OK， 所以他回来。好，这是要做一个沙的测试，所以我用了一点点的粘土。There's more clay on the one that she has in her hand. Okay, 好，呃，我等一下要测试一个什么是我们要的土，我们要的土会长什么样子。She will demonstrate to us. 对。What kind of subsoil mixture do we desire? 对，这个粘土很纯，这是没有粘土。The one on the left is very pure in clay, and on the right. With the gravel, there is no clay. 好，好，我们现在做一个测试。She will demonstrate. 这是最纯的粘土。The purest clay. 嗯，跟站直的状况下，手背平举。Keep your arms straight. 手背平举。Ninety degrees to your body. 对，然后我待会会坠落到地面。Okay. One, two, three. Okay, this is the result of pure clay. It is flattened out almost half its height. No 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 flattened out almost half its height. This is a very pure clay. 嗯，这个含了一点沙。The second demonstration has some sand. 细的沙一样，手背平举。Keep your arms straight. 啊！好，你可以再过来看一点。一样，从一颗球掉下来，变成一半。比它还要低。After the drop, the second version has even less height than the first. 嗯，比它低的原因是因为它没吃饱，还没吃饱。The reason is it is not full. 嗯，比它低的原因是因为它含沙比较多，所以它会比较弹。The reason being, there is more sand consisting within this ball, second ball, and there will this will create a flattened effect. 嗯，然后再来，你会看到有裂纹。And there are cracks along the edges. 就是完全的沙，没有任何的，没有任何的粘土，没有任何的粘土。One hundred percent gravel. 啊，旁边一点。On this side. One, two, three. This disperses completely. This just has a small amount of clay. One, two, three. Oh! Like, very like it. Very similar to the gravel effect. Okay, this is one and two together. This last globular has the initial clay in one part and two parts gravel. One, two, three. In this consistency, there is height like the first one, and there are cracks like the gravel. Okay, 那所以这个就是我们要的。This is what we want. 嗯，太黏。太少，太。The first is too sticky. 嗯。And the gravel is too loose. 如果你在你的土地挖出来，上面前三十公分都不要，或是五十公分都不要。对。On your land, the first initial thirty centimeters 
to the first 50 centimeters in depth, you discard. Sometimes within 30 centimeters, you will get a clay-like consistency like the first one. Sometimes it takes 50. Unless you are in the desert or in a special region, or in a very rocky mountainous area, otherwise, you most likely can get clay on your property. So, we the hand test is what we use to see if there is enough clay in your consistency. Perfect! The, third <laughs> demonst the, last step, the third demonstration is what we want. It's perfect. You won't need more gravel or more clay. That is what we want. If it's like this, then this is, there's trouble. You must find the first two and then mix with the gravel to create the third glob. This is what we desire. Okay.